Oh, I can't wait to see what he makes up of this. Oh, great. Didn't already call that being random. Impossible. I'm telling you, right now that is impossible. I have a... Hold on one second. I have pictures here. Right here. That's like the entire left stage. How is that not the red coat assassin? How is there a second coat that happens to be all the way on the left side? You are BSing, sir. That means it makes you even more suspicious. Exactly. I hate you, good sir. Pain? visible in that photo. Oh, balding head. Okay, I guess that is pain. <laughs> Fair enough. What are you trying to get at here? Yes? What is so strange about this? Chief, Mr. Payne, and the Assassin, yes. During the President's speech. Do I? The only thing I have to do with the President's speech is this. No. No way. Take that. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Do I have to present it? The person who should be in this photo is Nicole Swift. Take that. How would she have gotten the audio from Payne and the Chief? You're just gonna stand there? Exactly. And she specifically said that it was the people in front of her. Boom! But this makes no sense. Maybe Doe's correct. A testimony. What? What? Okay. Fair enough, that makes a lot of sense, but... Does the... I, I wanna relook at this. Does the... What happens? Oh yeah, she has a big, like, monologue. She fast-forwarded between it. Right, okay. I was about to say, if she didn't fast forward, then you're screwed, because then the bullet would have already gone off. I'm not I'm not pulling anything here. I don't think Nicole's the assassin. I don't want it to be her. What? 
What? Okay. Okay, I was moving around the audience. <gasps> no, 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 no. I got it, okay. This is very convoluted, but... In the tape, Kay, or I guess Nicole, ends up saying, the president raises his fist in the air. And the picture here raises his hand in the air. Let's go for it. Booyah! Why are you lying, Swift? You are lying. I can tell. I can smell it. Truth lies in the photos. What part of this photo do you want? No more than the president's fist. Take that! With his fist raised in the air? Let's go back to your testimony, shall we? Exactly. I have it in my organizer, you should hit, like... No matter what sort of hideous crime or... Yep, so this is pain. Okay, yeah. There you go. Tape was recorded. That means... She is in the photo. She's the person in the red coat. Dude, like... This is insane! You don't have the red raincoat in question. It's got to be her. Wait, what? Oh, okay. Thinking about the wrong coat. The right sleeve with the button torn off was stained with red blood. Okay. I thought they were asking... Okay, the red raincoat in question does belong to John Doe. That's easy. You were wearing something else. Just as Don John Doe said. Red hood. What about her parka? Why is... Why is that a big deal? Oh gosh, are you kidding me? Examine this parka. Then it should be what? All I need is my trusty parka. Then it should be dry. No. You I, this is insane that she's the assassin, though.
You have to tell me. I don't want it to believe it's you either, Nicole. You help me, I help you. Yeah, whose voice was that? Was it Doe's? Whoa! It's one of the bodyguards. Yes. Your name is? Cool gun twirling, dude. Horace Knightley. So you were the guy on the left. Right. Right side, sorry. Right side. Fair enough. The good news? Mr. Fancy Suit. Start with the good news. Not even a scratch? That's that's good. Not <laughs> good for you, Nicole. Rook. Mr. Ethan Rook. He died? Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, you seem super concerned. About chess gum shoe. Oh my gosh. That guy sure talks funny. Yes. Why? What's the doozy? Ah, oh, great. We're gonna see Zlong Lang again. Great. That may not be a bad thing, I like him, but like... <laughs> he's not necessarily the most reasonable of police officers. Or Interpol, or whatever you want to call him. Yeah. Mm-hmm. This is American soil! No capiche. She's fleeing. Zengfa or country though is not necessarily the most sane group of people. She doesn't seem to be the assassin. No. 
It is not. Exactly. To be continued? Nope. Who screamed? Please be the president! Whoa, 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 whoa! There you go. Who? What? I think we know who this guy is. How is he out of our league? Exactly. It's the professional assassin, Shelly Dekiller. Returning from justice for all. So technically he's not out of our league, because Edgeworth was involved with that case. Exactly, you and Phoenix, one of the most insane cases ever. Exactly. Curses! What calculations? What game? You gonna play chess? What? Why does he care about me? What is what does the killer want with me? You didn't kill him? Fair enough, but... Oh my gosh. <laughs> Pain. <laughs> I don't have any objections, but we can remove the knife. Gather up all your men. Oh. They're not letting to kill her off. Okay.